After a long day exercising, doing science stuff, eating and pooping, <laughs> it's time for astronauts to go to bed. But they don't use a bed. So how do you go to bed if you don't have a bed? So this is Node 2. This is a really cool module. Um, of course, most of these modules you'll see they have four sides uh, and they're put together. That way we could sort of work on a flat plane, either a wall, a floor, another wall, or the ceiling. But you know, again, all you have to do is turn yourself and your reference changes. The reason I'm bringing that up is because this is where four out of six of us sleep. And so people always ask about sleeping in space. Do you lie down? Are you in a bed? Um, not really, because it doesn't matter. You don't really have the sensation of lying down. You just sit in your sleeping bag. So here's one sleep station right here. I'm going in right now. You can follow me if you want. I can't lie down because there's no gravity to lie down with. So I'm inside. It's sort of like a little phone booth, um, but it's pretty comfy. I've got a sleeping bag right here that we sleep in, so we don't have a, sort of like a little bit of a cover. We don't fly all over the place. Um, but you know, you can sleep in any orientation. I have it sleeping, feeling like I'm standing up right now, but like you saw, I'm on the floor, but it doesn't matter if I turn over and I sleep upside down. I can't have it, I don't have any sensation in my head that tells me that I'm upside down, so it really doesn't matter. The sleep station is also like a little office. We've got a computer in here. As you can see, we've got a couple little toys. I've got some books, I've got some clothes, and other things that make it sort of like home. I'm coming out. And just for reference, that's one sleep station. This one's another, right here. There's one on the ceiling, if you want to call it right here, and then there's a fourth on the other wall over here. So all of us sleep in a little bit of a, a circle. I, a lot of people have asked how astronauts sleep at night. Well, we sleep in sleeping bags. We have our own individual crew quarters. I'm sticking my head out of mine right now. And if we're wearing pajamas, I'm wearing regular clothes right now, we put on our pajamas, and then we get into our sleeping bags like this. great sleeping bag. And what's really cool about it is we can zip it up and then we have little armholes. That way if you want to you can sleep with your arms floating. Some people like that. Some people like to get snugged up inside. But when we wake up what I like to do is take my arms out. I start my day by getting on the computer and reading what Mission Control has sent up, reading procedures, and reading up on the news just like you might do at home. And then it's time to get up. And it's off to start the day. Here's the Earth at night as seen from the ISS, the International Space Station. All those bright lights are cities. And the bigger the light, the bigger the city. It's nighttime there on Earth. That's why it's so dark. We know it's around bedtime when the sun sets, but because the ISS is orbiting around the Earth so fast, they actually see 16 sunsets every day. So it's a little confusing for astronauts to get to sleep every night. Astronauts have very busy days, but they still make time to have fun and play games and goof around. So far, everything's been so different with everything, with eating, sleeping, exercising, do you think games will be different too? Let's find out in part seven.